Hey guys, welcome to HNS Academy. So Windows 11 is finally here as it has been officially announced by uh, Microsoft yesterday. So no more leaked versions anymore. Uh, and the good thing about this is that it is going to be completely free for the Windows 10 users. So if you have Windows 10 license, you'll be able to upgrade freely um, to the Windows 11 when those upgrades are going to be available, which is probably going to be later in this year or early 2022. Now we're going to talk about one of the highlights of yesterday's updates, and that is Windows 11 is going to support Android apps. So yes, that means that you will now be able to run your Android apps on Windows 11 natively. Now the way those apps are going to be available is that those apps will be available through the Microsoft Store and then again not directly from Microsoft Store, uh, those apps would be coming from Amazon App Store uh, actually. So it seems that uh, Amazon Store, uh, if we look at the Microsoft Store currently, so there is a possibility that Amazon Store might get uh, integrated into this Microsoft Store as a section over here where you'll be able to find uh, the Android apps. Now, here's a small drawback of this that if we talk about Amazon App Store, uh, it doesn't have all the Android apps and like the Google Play Store. So you might not be able to have all your favorite um, Android applications over here because of the limited availability of apps on the Amazon App Store. But again, um, there's a good news for especially for the TikTok users because Microsoft uh, demonstrated in their uh, demo for Windows 11 as well that TikTok is definitely there and it will be, they've actually shown how it runs on the PC or Windows 11. So this seems to be a major update um, or the major highlight of the yesterday's update uh, as Android apps are now going to be available on Windows 11. Now this is going to be very useful for a lot of users and it is going to, it means that you won't need those emulators or the mirroring apps to, to get your uh, Android apps to work on PC. So it is going to be very useful even for me as well. So I won't have to use um, the mirroring or other apps to demonstrate those uh, Android uh, apps uh, for my tutorials. So that is all for today's video. Hope this was helpful and you got the new update regarding the Windows 11. So that's all for today's video and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye.